TGSI, Tactile Ground Surface Indicators. What are tactile tiles? Who are they for? Where are they used? Tactile tiles have a significant surface texture which can be felt through the shoes. This is particularly useful for people with visual impairment. The pattern on the TGSI protrudes by 5 millimeters from the surface. What are the pattern types? Warning or attention? Guiding. Their purpose is to guide people with visual impairment or blindness. The different patterns on the tiles indicate different situations, either a warning pattern for a nearby hazard or guiding from one place to another. Where are tactile tiles required? These are required in all public areas on footpaths, next to bus stops, next to all lifts, toilets, ticketing counters, water fountains, or any other feature in shopping malls, transportation hubs, office blocks, schools, entertainment and sports complexes, and all other public locations. If you can imagine yourself in an area unknown to you and you cannot see, what would be your main concern? Probably slipping, tripping, falling, TGSI provide a modified surface that provide a physical sensation through your footwear. These give warning of a potential hazard or guide you from one area to another. TGSI installation formats. Wherever the floor surface is tiled, the TGSI tiles can be combined. The stud type are fitted into holes drilled into the surface. These can be pavers or concrete. Even tiles can be drilled. This type can also be useful for natural stone finishes or anywhere where there is a requirement for retrofitting of TGSI. In some areas there is a requirement for greater durability and this is generally where pavers are used. So the TGSI paver will be combined with the other pavers or the other surface. The final type is adhesive. These are stuck to the floor. Summary. TGSI are tactile by the way of the protruding texture which can be felt through the shoes. The purpose of these tiles is to provide information to people who cannot see the features and hazards around them. TGSI should be placed where there is need of a warning for those who are blind or visually impaired. These places include the edge of platforms, before the first step of any stairway, before any ramp, in front of doors to toilets, main entrances, ATMs, bus stops, lifts, etc. One final type of tile can be found, fake tactile tiles. These can generally be found wherever there is competitive bidding, where the contract is awarded to the lowest bidder. And these can often be found in government contracts. The problem with these tiles is that they have a low profile for the protrusions, the dots or the lines or guiding strips. While these look exactly the same as tactile tiles, these fake tiles have a very low profile and therefore cannot be felt through the shoe.